After two years not being able to perform the Nutcracker, the Premier Dance Company is back with their production at the Civic Center for the 30th anniversary this weekend. It's a big mix of emotions because it's like coming, it's almost like coming home again. Charlene White, the artistic director of the Premier Dance Company, says she's excited to direct the Nutcracker once again after its two years absence because of COVID-19. It was it, it was heartbreaking to not be able to to do this those past two years. And there's such a um, group of children that have grown up doing this. So it was really, really hard to not do those um, two performances. The toughest part for White not being able to perform the Nutcracker was seeing her students miss out on the big performance. I have dancers who will be dancing this weekend who were once little mice and I have watched them through the years go through each of the different parts and all of a sudden they're the dewdrop fairy or the snow queen or the sugar plum fairy or even Clara and that to me is what the success of this Nutcracker is. White is no rookie on directing the Nutcracker. She's been doing it with the Premier Dance Company for the 30 years they've performed it, and each year her performers leave her impressed. I don't know what it is, but it just seems like the stage lights up, the curtain opens, and they take it over, and they deliver every single year. She said the Nutcracker wouldn't mean anything if it weren't for the community supporting it. It's just heartwarming that the Helena community keeps coming back and supporting it. So I just feel like we are, we're getting something back from the community and I feel like every holiday we're giving them a, a great gift of the Nutcracker. I'm clearly not cut out for this, but the ones that are will be performing here at the Civic Center on Saturday, December 17th at 7, and here on Sunday, December 18th at 2. In Helena, Ryan Berg, MTN News.